Just having that bag right in front of the hole in that last round. Sometimes they can do a short airmail and drag their own bag in. Again, Rawls goes for the block and deflects Birchfield off to the left. A new shot to talk about here, a bully shot. He's going to try to go directly at this bag so that he knocks it out of the way. He came up a little bit short, which I think he's okay with. He still maintains what we call hole control, which is your bag placed in the center. But now pretty plain and simple. You see him taking a deep breath. This is a difficult shot. He may flip it over onto the faster side of the bag, the slick side. He wants to go up through the middle. If he gets the bonus of pushing this out of the way, great. But at best, worst, I mean, at worst, he wants to take all three bags. Oh, and, and able to get one in and the other two right there on the edge. And I think the difference was he stayed with the tackier side of the bag. And now Birchfield has created goalposts. I mean, normally I wouldn't say it's very simple to push three bags in at once, but this is as simple as it gets when you got those bumpers. Going right up the middle, and he does. Takes all three in. And now Birchfield, a quick toss out of frustration, flips his in. But a six-point round for Alex Rawls, and now a huge lead. That is a huge round here. 10 to 2, make it 16 to 2. And that time was the difference. You see, he flipped it over onto the slick side of the bag.